Hi guys, I'm from Quantonics Research Group, and uh, I'm here to explain the explain something about the uh, wire explosion experiment and device we have here. First of all, uh, uh, for this experiment, we pour 400 milliliter uh, deionized water in the container, and we put the lid. We close it to fix that container. We put the container in the device. And uh, uh, as you can see, a silver wire uh, had to go down and dip into the water. I, I pulled the wire and put it into the container in the special rod. And now, with the container fixed, uh, we had to attach the contacts to apply the voltage, the high voltage we want. We can close the door of the device and uh, by uh, setting the voltage, uh, time, and feed rate, we can perform the experiment. The voltage is set to 250, kilo, uh, 250 volts. We keep the time uh, at 20 minutes and the feed rate at 2.3 centimeters. The wire is going down with a rate of 2.3 centimeters into the water to be uh, broken into parts and to create nanowires. Now we press the play button and uh, the high voltage is applied as you can see in the device. The first spark is, has, has been observed in, in the deionized water and we have to wait until the 30th one and uh, now, uh, after the 30th one, the water goes dark and we can, ha we can have uh, our nanowires in a range of uh, almost 59 nanometers. Now we can stop the performance, the experiment actually. Uh, 30th shot has been reached and we have almost 59 nanoparticles but they're not stabilized yet. In order to prevent their aggregation and in order to make them stabilized in the solution, we have to use some surfactant. You can see the solution here. We add the, the surfactant. We pour some to some uh, special container and add some surfactant to the solution. And to complete the stabilization process, we have to uh, put it in the ultrasonic device we have here. And we expect to have uh, the stabilized solution and nanoparticles we desire. After almost 10 minutes, uh, we have our nanoparticles stabilized. We can take the container out. And you can see them. 
and the solution is stabilized using the surfactant and ultrasonic waves. Thank you guys. Uh, please subscribe to our Quantonics YouTube channel. Bye for now.